this please note down these notes have been uploaded in the description of video please download your notes dear students in this lecture i will clear the pinus it is a gymnosperm the pinus the gymnosperm plant dear students in this lecture we will discuss systematic portion classification of pinus that is a gymnosperm plant as well as in this lecture i will clear external features or morphology of pinus tree first of all we will discuss systematic portion classification particularly bsc students second year students not down important question for final exam systematic portion its classification of pinus kingdom plantic division spermatophyta dear students spermatophyta sperm means seed phyta plant it means these are seed producing plants subdivision gymnospermy not down gymnospermy these are plants with produce seeds but seeds remain naked as in these gymnosperms no flowers no fruits generally seeds are present inside the ovary or fruit but here fruit is absent so seeds are naked class coniferopsita not down each and every point coniferopsita it means these gymnosperm the pinus these are corn bearing plants which produce a corn means reproductive organs produce special structures named corns order coniferales these are evergreen trees because the leaves which are needle like so these are named pinus the needle like the leaves and these leaves persist from 3 to 10 years so these are evergreen trees leaves needle like but persist about 10 years reproductive structures are arranged in the form of corns and here in gymnosperm the pinus the male gametes and the male gametes always non motile family pinaceae that is pine family of conifer trees or shrubs dear students it its genus that is pinus and the pinus its two most common species are pinus roxburghi or it is pinus longifolia that is commonly named cheer pine or in hindi language it is cheer tree another important example of pinus that is pinus giraldina it is chilgocha pine and this chilgocha pine its seeds are commonly used as delicious dry fruits now we will discuss external features morphology of pinus tree that is a gymnosperm it is perennial plant which persists several years it is evergreen plant because the needle like leaves which remain on the plant from 3 to 10 years and these are chirophyte chirophytes dear students these plants pinus which grow in jarric dry conditions these are chirophytic sporophyte not down each and every point sporophyte it means the adult plant body that is sporophyte that produce spores two types of spores microspores and megaspores later on i will discuss all these things entire plant body and this plant body is differentiated into three parts root system the roots the stem and the needle like leaves first of all we will discuss root here in pinus the first root primary root or tap root that root persists throughout the life but it is shorter as compared the other roots lateral roots secondary roots because in this pinus tree the length of primary root tap root is short while the growth of lateral secondary roots which are extensively extensively developed and 
the lateral roots are more stronger, well developed as compared to tap root primary root. No doubt, in pinus, the characteristic feature of pinus roots very important for competitive exams. The root hair are poorly developed, or dear student, the root hair are replaced by mycorrhiza. Myco means fungus, rhiza are the roots. It means the pinus roots associate with fungus and the fungi which particularly belong to basidiomycetes. Not down the fungal hyphae and the fungal hyphae which associate with pinus root because that is a symbiotic association. The fungus which obtains nourishment, organic food from the plant. But these fungal hyphae which provide water and minerals. Dear students, the mycorrhiza may be of two types. One is ectotrophic or ectomycorrhiza. As name indicate ectomycorrhiza, ectotrophic. In this fungal hyphae, do not penetrate in deep tissues of plant roots. It means the fungal hyphae remain over the root surface. Ectomycorrhiza. But in endomycorrhiza, ectotrophic, the fungal hyphae penetrate into the plant roots in deep parts. On the basis of shape, the mycorrhiza may be of three types, coralloid, the tuberous and the nodulated, not down. In case of coralloid roots, the roots become irregular shape. In tuberous, the shape is very clear like a tube, but in this nodulated, a small nodule, rounded, knob-like structure develop. Stem. The stem is elongated, it is erect, columnar and the stem produce two types of branches. It means in case of pinus, the branches are dimorphic, two types of branches. One is long shoot having unlimited growth because the apical bud and that apical bud remains active throughout the life. It means the growth remains unlimited. That is long shoot and in case of second shoot, second branches and these are dwarf shoot or branches having limited growth because in this dwarf or these are spur shoot or these are also named brachii blast. Not down each and every point for competitive exams. This is long shoot. It is having an apical but as a result the growth remains unlimited but here in case of dwarf shoot there is no apical but growth is limited and this dwarf shoot having a limited growth also named spar shoot or it is brachii blast dear students note down these needle like leaves and the needle like leaves the foliage leaves and these foliage leaves only present, not down, only on dwarf shoot. The leaves, the leaves in case of pinus are dimorphic. It means two types of leaves. The small leaves which are scale leaves. And these elongated needle-like leaves which are evergreen. These are photosynthetic. These are foliage leaves. In pinus, the branches are of two types, long shoot, dwarf shoot, unlimited growth of branches, limited growth of branches, that is spar shoot or it is brachii blast. Leaves are of dimorphic. The scale leaves, the scale leaves are present on both long and dwarf shoot. But dear student, these foliage leaves not down always develop over dwarf shoot and the number of these foliage or needle leaves 
दैट नंबर इज फिक्सड इन डिफरेंट स्पेसेस एज इन केस ऑफ पाइनस मोनोफाइला ऑन दिस डुआर शूट ओनली वन नीड लाइक फोलियस लीव दैट इज कॉल्ड मोनोफोलियर टू लीव्स डाइफोलियर थ्री लीव्स ट्राइफोलियर हियर इन केस ऑफ pinus armandi that is pentafolial having five needle like leaves this is all about pinus general systematic portion classification and its external morphology or its features of pinus